Welcome back to Germ Prevention Strategies. This is slide two of four. Okay, social distancing, social distancing. The CDC, the Center for Disease Control and Prevention. What is social distancing? Social distancing, also called physical distancing, means keeping space between yourself and other people outside of your home. To practice social or physical distancing, stay at least six feet from other people, two meters. Do not gather in group. Stay out of crowded places and avoid mass gathering. We're going to continue on this. In addition to everyday steps to prevent COVID-19, Keeping space between you and others is one of the best tools we have to avoid being exposed to this virus and slowing its spread locally and across the country and world. When COVID-19 is spreading in your every area, everyone should limit close contact with individuals outside your household in indoor and outdoor spaces. Since people can spread the virus before they know they are sick, it is important to stay away from others when possible. Even if you have no symptoms, Social distancing is especially important for people who are at high risk of getting sick. Okay, tips for social distancing. Follow guidance from authorities where you live, in your community. If you need to shop for food or medicine at the grocery store or pharmacy, stay at least six feet away from others. Use mail orders for medications if possible. Consider a grocery delivery service. When you have to go out in public, for example, to the grocery store, stay at least six feet between yourself and others, even when you wear a face covering. Avoid large and small gatherings in private places and public spaces such as parks, restaurants, shops, or any other place. This advice applies to people, even teens and younger adults. I would like to share a story, a personal story of mine. Uh, I was in the store the other day, and uh, I was practicing social distancing, and there was a gentleman behind me. He was six feet apart. I had on my mask. He coughed and sneezed, and the cashier, once I approached her, she said, was that you cough or sneeze? I said, no, it wasn't. I didn't look back towards that gentleman. I just told her, no, it wasn't. Paid for my items, and I walked out. Across America, there's a lot of conflicts going on because people are getting into power struggles behind this here pandemic. People do not want to be blamed. People are paranoid. And it really is causing a lot of headaches for people, anxiety. So we must remain aware. We must remain knowledgeable about of what's going on with this pandemic. And I'm pretty sure others have experienced some isolated incidents as well. Right now, we're going to take another break and um, on germ prevention strategy, and we will resume uh, later on. Thank you. <laughs> 